Meanwhile, following the government ban on popular video platform TikTok, many Nepal for whom the app acted as a source of income are worried over the loss as work is in shambles. They say the ban not only deprives people of a source of recreation, but also takes away a forum for free speech. Nepali content creator Manjita Manandhar was caught off guard when the government banned the popular social media platform TikTok in the Himalayan nation last week for disturbing social harmony and goodwill. Manandhar, who was among the many Nepali content creators for whom the video platform acted as a source of income, says her business has halved since the ban. Scores of people in capital Kathmandu have also held protests to demand the government to revoke the ban, while others filed petitions against it at the Supreme Court, citing that the ban on TikTok has shut down a forum for free speech. Two days back, TikTok ban boy again. Our business the pure half boy, isn't it? Subway Instagram and TikTok soche ra, my le tiyabar aani income soche ra, my le invest kori ra scale up kori ko. अनि मैले त्यही अनुसार एक महिना अगाडि देखि नै क्लायन्टहरुलाई चाहिँ यो प्रमिस गरिसकेको हुन्छु कि यो टाइममा चाहिँ तपाईहरुको पोस्ट आउँछ यहाँ यहाँ पोस्ट हुन्छ भनेर त्यही अनुसारको प्रमिस भइसकेको हुन्छ त्यही अनुसारको प्लानिङ भइसकेको हुन्छ जुन सबै नै डामाडोल भयो के अब अब क्लायन्टलाई के आन्सर दिने नेपाल इज द लेटेस्ट टु ब्यान टिकटक व्हिच इज ओन्ड बाइ चाइना बेस्ड बाइट डान्स Authorities have claimed more than 1,600 cyber crimes related to TikTok have been registered in Nepal. Several countries, including India, have also raised concerns over the app's proximity to the Chinese government and its hold over user data across the world.